And we begin with a case of yard vandalism that's the focus of a police investigation. A person was caught on video spraying an intentional ward with chemicals. Good evening, I'm Mike Duffy. The damage was discovered near North Selfridge and Stephen Avenue in Clawson. 7 Action News reporter Darren Cunningham spoke to the homeowner who's not letting the act change her views. This is a path Jamie Gills Tekanucci says she's walked for about 15 years now in her Clawson neighborhood. But a stroll earlier in the week led to this unexpected discovery, a message in her grass. And they were very um, clear, right? You don't see a whole lot of drips or anything except mm -hmm. off the top of the W. She says someone vandalized her lawn and it was caught on a neighbor's home surveillance camera. This is footage that's been turned over to Clawson police. Thursday, May 18th at 5.15 in the morning, someone is seen walking their dog and they stop at Gills Tekanucci and her husband's lawn. As it appears, they use an unknown substance to spell out the word woke. According to the Merriam-Webster Dictionary, woke means to be, quote, aware of and actively attentive to important societal facts and issues, especially racial and social justice, end quote. Gils Takanucci says back in 2020, someone destroyed some of her Black Lives Matter yard signs. Other than that, she says she's never been confronted nor had any arguments with anyone about her beliefs. My views are a minority here. Um, you know, and that's okay. You know, I have great neighbors that disagree with me, um, you know, and they're great people and would never do anything like that. She says she posted about this on the Clawson Community Forum Facebook page to find out if anyone else has been impacted about what happened on her family's lawn. This shouldn't become a us against them thing, right? It was one person. One person did this and that person needs to, you know, be held accountable to that. Gills Tekanucci says she doesn't see the word woke as an insult. In fact, she says she accepts the word, but not the vandalism. If anybody's curious, you know, about my views or why I think them, you know, stop and talk to me. Don't write in my lawn. In Clawson, Darren Cunningham, 7 Action News.